Hello from St. Louis, Missouri, the Gateway City. Behind us is the Gateway Arch. It's the world's tallest arch and America's tallest monument. The stainless steel arch stands 192 meters high and was completed in 1965. It is a symbol of the important role this city played as early settlers headed west. The arch was built to commemorate the 300,000 people who came west after Jefferson made the Louisiana Purchase. Louisiana Purchase doubled the size of the country. Before that, everybody out east was getting a little restless, getting a little, they wanted a little more opportunity, a little more economic advantage. People came west, they came through St. Louis because it was the last large city that they could actually get uh, goods and provisions. In the 1930s, Route 66 was the road of opportunity for migrants heading west. Hundreds of thousands of Americans left the plains for the promised land of California. They were fleeing an historic drought that had turned the land to dust. John Steinbeck wrote about Route 66 in his classic novel, The Grapes of Wrath. 66 is the path of a people in flight. Refugees from dust and shrinking land, from the thunder of tractors and shrinking ownership, from the desert's slow northward invasion, from the twisting winds that howl up out of Texas, from the floods that bring no richness to the land and steal what little richness is there. From all of these, the people are in flight, and they come into 66 from the tributary side roads, from the wagon tracks and the rutted country roads. 66 is the mother road, the road of flight. <laughs>